All right, hey guys, here, real another little short, quick video here. I'm about ready to put these up. These are what was left out of my box of these I ordered online. These are the flapper valves for the Elger Windsor Low Boy Toilet. And there's probably a couple other uh, Low Boy toilets that may use the, our Elger toilets that use these. I think that Elger uh, Canterbury used them too. That one I got that guy to put in his house. Very similar. In fact, it looked like the same flapper. Um, and you can see this is uh, for Elger Low Boy toilets. So these are the ones I got. Now the reason that these look like a regular flapper, but they're different. I got this one opened up just to show you. Um, they look the same and all. This is styrofoam here. Okay, and they have the chain, which, you know, just like a normal flapper valve. The only difference is, you notice they're closed on the end here. Okay, well, the, so are the rubber ones. However, um, the flush valve assembly in the back of the toilet, um, on, the, on the Windsor Little Boy Toilet, on the Elger, and the little studs that stick out uh, where the flapper goes, they're very short. I mean, they barely stick out past the, the flapper uh, assembly here. And uh, on your other toilet, you know, you have that little L shape that sticks up. So you got to put the loop like, you know, like that and kind of maningle it over that little piece that sticks up to, and then scoot it over on the flush valve. Not so on these. Uh, you have to spring these apart. These are a little springy, as you can see. I don't want to bend on it too much. Camera's kind of out of focus, which is not anything unusual. But yeah, you see how they're springy? You have to spread them apart just enough to snap that up over those stu studs and it locks in place. And of course you measure your chain length and you know, go about your normal business. So yeah, so that's how that works. Just wanted to show you guys that and that's why the, um, I tried a rubber one on the, the toilet before I, when I replaced it with the other new one when I got these in, just to see what would happen. Now it fit on there, no problem. It sealed. The, the tank held water, but the minute that I pushed the flush valve, the flush handle to open it, one side of that popped right off of that, and the flapper just went loose in the tank. So it will they will not stay on there. They have to be this hard plastic, and they snap on. So just thought I would show you that. I'm going to put that back in the package. So I got some spare ones. So yeah, that's what you'll need, folks. Uh, I got these online. There might be some hardware stores that might still carry these. I don't know what model, different other model toilets that these might fit. Um, for, by, for Elger, so they might fit some of the newer stuff, so they might be just the hardware stores around here, you know, Lowe's, Home Depot, all them places didn't have any. They're trying to carry toilets, parts that are you know, like 10 years old or newer. Uh, they don't, they're trying to cut down their supply, so, but some of the little mom and pop stores might still carry these, but if not, you can get them online. So, alright, well, thanks for watching, guys.